whether you're trying to vlog, podcast, stream, or record instruments, there's nothing else that's going to make or break your videos like audio quality. There's no quicker way to make your videos seem amateur than to have bad audio quality. So today, we're gonna to turn this into crispy, smooth, ultra clear audio that sounds like it was recorded in a professional studio, because it was. Oh, hey, welcome, come on in. So I just moved into a new place about two months ago and I'll give you the tour of the whole place later if you're interested. But I've been working on setting up a little bit of a recording studio upstairs. I've got most of my stuff moved over now and I've sort of been setting that up and getting that ready to go. But I'm still missing one key thing that I haven't done yet to it and that's what we're gonna work on today. So welcome, here's my new space. Nice little home recording setup. Instruments right there, ready for recording. My little uh, closet full of equipment right there. My computer station, if you watched previous videos, this was in the old studio, but now I finally moved it over here. And carefully hidden in the closet, I've got my computer. Kept it in the closet because the fans are so loud, so I have to keep them hidden so that I can actually get good quality recordings. And my favorite part of the whole room is that it looks out on the city. Now the huge problem I've got right now with this room is that it sounds terrible. It's basically a big square cube with awful echoes everywhere. So no matter what I do, I'm never gonna be able to get a good recording out of this room here as it stands. Think of trying to record in your school gym. It's got huge echoes everywhere and it just sounds awful. I've got this $800 microphone right here, but that doesn't do me any good because the room sounds terrible, so I couldn't get a good recording here if I tried. So today, we're going to do the most important step to making a room sound good, to give you a professional sound, acoustic treatment. It's not nearly as sexy as getting a new guitar or amp or speaker system or whatever, but if you're looking to make your recordings, whether you're streaming or vlogging or recording instruments, twice as good and get a real actual professional sound, then acoustic treatment is gonna do way more than getting any of that new gear. I've already picked up all the supplies to build this stuff, so that's what we're doing today. Let's get started. Okay, so here's the master plan. I need to make three panels that are four feet wide. They're all four feet long. I need to make two that are one foot, two that are three feet wide, and I've got one roof cloud, and this is my whole drawing for it. It's gonna be a bit of a pile of everything. Uh, but we'll put that together and this should cover basically the entire roof. I've got it all measured out. This is for the ceiling cloud. Those are for the four foot wide panels. Those are for the three foot wide ones and that's the one footers. Should be enough. Let's try cutting. Basically what I'm doing here is making a giant cloud of insulation to hang from the ceiling to stop all the echoes that hit the roof. And this is my whole drawing for it. It's gonna be a bit of a pile of everything, uh, but we'll put that together and this should cover basically the entire roof. Yeah. 
Ceiling Cloud Frame, done. Woo! Well, that sucks. What we ended up doing was putting acoustic panels on all the walls and a giant ceiling cloud covering most of the ceiling. And really what this does is mostly just absorb all the echoes that come from the room so that really you're just getting my voice straight into the microphone or your voice into the microphone or the guitar you're recording or whatever instrument. And you don't have all this extra room noise that kind of affects the recording. So you just get this crisp, clear, polished sound that doesn't have all this extra stuff in it. So if you're someone who's looking to record YouTube videos or blog or podcast or whatever, record instruments, this is probably the simplest and most effective thing that you're gonna be able to do to improve your audio quality and your recording quality. It definitely helps to have a good microphone. That's absolutely gonna improve your recording quality. I almost bought these panels, but I decided to build them in the end because they're actually pretty easy to make and they're like five times cheaper if you make them yourself. One last thing to be careful of is on Amazon, there are a lot of these cheap foam panels and they're really not very good. They'll do a little bit for your high frequencies, but they're not really gonna do much to improve the overall sound. They're better than nothing, but an actual full panel is gonna do you a lot more good using rigid insulation or thick acoustic insulation from Home Depot or Lowe's or buying a panel from a professional place. But in the end, something is better than no treatment. So if that's what's in your budget, then go for that by all means. It's all gonna sound a lot better than just your empty room. That's all I've got for you today. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please comment, like, and subscribe to see more of my videos. And I'll see you soon.